Today I'm interviewing a student from our Fort Worth School at the Fort Worth Hope Center, Lusa Foriano, and I want him to share his testimony of what he experienced here at the Hope Center. Lusa, tell us about your classes. When did you go to class? Uh, I went to class on in November, November 4th. I finished one week later, and then I got my certification and my license too, uh, from Russia, of course. And uh, the experience was good, was good. Um, the employer was wonderful. Instructors and all the staffing right here work as a positive, as a family. Uh, my experience, I mean, for me, was something else that I had in my life, in my career too. Uh, I'm so grateful to, to know that place because they helped me a lot. From them, I could find my job after two weeks when I finished my, my, my forklift course. And um, I wish, or I, I can advise everybody to come visit uh, Hope Center. Uh, you're gonna like it. It doesn't take it so long, so it's like one week, you can, or 30 hours, you can get your certification or your, your license for forklift too. Tell us about, thank you for that compliment. Thank Tell you. us about your experience after you graduated. How long did it take you to get a, a job? Yes, uh, it took me like uh, only two weeks. Mm -hmm. When I finished I, uh, the first week, I did the application for many companies. One of the company called me at far, and uh, I went there, they said, okay, we're gonna apply you. Uh, we saw you, you got your certification from Hobson. and I said, yes. So uh, they asked me, how was it? I said, I was normally, I did my course, and they, I said, yeah, um, they hire me, they, they start paying me, and they pay good. They pay me thirteen seventy five. So I say, okay, because I, I have my certification. Because if you don't have a certification, they don't gonna know how the things work. So um, I'm glad the experience is good, is good because Hop Center did the job, and um, I could find a good, uh, good employment for 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 for, for me. And so you've started working in January. No, no. When did you start? November. Uh, I started November. November. Yeah. And you you started with the temp service, which put you in a place of employment, and then they've moved you to a new place. Tell me how the temp service has helped you gain a wider range of experience. Yes, uh, temp temp service is helped me a lot because I can work on different and different environment from warehouses. Uh, every warehouse, they have different things to do. A lot of them you just do load, unloading truck, and that's it, or moving some stuff. But another one, you can do extra, extra, extra thing like uh, packing, uh, shipping, uh, or something else. And the dog experience for me is good because one, I can go some some uh, different warehouse. I know already a pass on that situation. That situation, or I did uh, those job is for me is doesn't gonna be a uh, very difficulty for yes for for, for myself and uh, for the companies. Well, that's exciting. Yeah. Thank you. Tell me about your homeland. Where did you? What's your? What company, country did you come from? And how long have you been in the states? Yes, um, uh, I am from Angola. Angola is a one of African country uh, between the South and the Central Africa. Uh, I have been in Dallas uh, for nine months already. I used to live in New York, just moved to Dallas. And um, when I when I get here, I was looking something to do. I was working in a, uh, in food processor. I said, no, no, I gotta look for some uh, the, for the center I can do for cliff driver. That's why I found the hub mm -hmm. center mm -hmm. and they helped me a lot for, to, to find out the dog. Yes. Yes. How did you find it? Did you find us on the internet or how did you find us? Uh, I found it on Google. On Google? And on Google. I went there, uh, I, I saw a lot of companies and I went to visit them. I saw the condition, the way it was, I said, okay, that's not, I cannot do here. And I came the first day I came in the hop center. Uh, every everyone, everyone take me as a as a as a as a son as a as a friend. They ask me, oh, what you wanna do? I wanna do a forklift driver. Okay, 
they spend me out they think you work over here so okay i'm gonna be here i'm gonna be i'm gonna do this course over here oh i'm excited yeah. you like that here yeah and yeah. when you go here you not only get to go to class but you have a meal every day and it's like family. yes ma'am I, I got meal every day I, <laughs> I, uh, every tuesday and the um, thir tuesday uh, uh, Tuesday and uh, Friday, right? I said, if I don't forget, I, I, I was talking um, uh, some food home, mm -hmm. and I have my my, my, num my ID number. I, I was talking some food home. I said that was amazing because I was I don't uh, I used to have food in my in my fridge mm -hmm. from from Hop Center. Mm -hmm. So that mean it helped me uh, twice. Helped mm -hmm. me on the profession and they helped me too. To, to, to have a food in, um, in my house too. That's great. Thank you. Now you told me late earlier that you are a refugee. Right. And you, your family had to flee the country because of the danger that was there. Is that right? Yes, ma'am. Uh, is a is a is a kind of experience that you you must have a big heart. You must have you must be a stronger to to move up for those situation. Uh, I know everybody knows how they think of working in Africa. It's not easy for for those people or like me to 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 be in that situation. Sometimes I don't like to talk, to to say that story because I know it's a sadness story. But I move on. I move on for next step. Is is important for me. Uh, I should or we should have more time to speak about that. But you know, uh, I'm a refugee. They think. Who, still going stuff in my country even me and even my family even those people stay there they try to do everything they can to leave the country they're gonna find something better or some place better that they can they can live in peace with security and uh, in equal equal opportunities well i'm so glad that you found your way here you said you went to new york first yes and then you managed to come down to texas right so we welcome you in Texas, the big heart of Texas here. <laughs> Thank you so much. And I'm so glad. I'm so happy to be in Texas because uh, he gave me something else. I just came to Texas to visit and they say, oh, I don't want to go back to New York. <laughs> yes, uh, Texas great. for me going to be my home, uh, going to be the place that everyone has a big heart mm -hmm. and the capacity to help each other. Yes. Well, does matter where you come from. Does matter where is uh, where is your color of skin. Does matter where is your religion. The the people over here they're friendly. They are family. So mm -hmm. that for me, I'm thankful for 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 that. That's awesome. Yeah. Well, we're so glad you have come and you're part of our our family here. We want to keep up with you. Mm -hmm. And when you do get find a permanent job, is I mean, you may want to stay at Temp forever because a lot of people do that. Right. But if you decide you want to log in somewhere and have a permanent job, be sure to get back in touch with us and let us know where that's going to be. Yes. Lord bless you. Okay. Thank you so much. Bye.